Good morning, everyone. You're going to notice that our reading assignments in the coming weeks are going to look um, decidedly different than what they have in the past. This is the new online platform that Benchmark Advance has created for online learning for anyone who subscribes to their curriculum. So we have decided as a third grade team to cut and paste some of these ideas and use them as our reading instruction, especially as it applies to asynchronous learning. To um, access these lessons, you're going to go to the directions page and notice that it says you're going to have to go into Clever to find the book you're reading. So the book, the story you're reading is not in your blue magazine. You have to go into Google, um, you have to go into Dodea Clever and you have to find the story to read. Then you're going to go to the Google slide that's attached in the lesson down here. This is the, your Google slide and you're going to see questions on slide one and then on slide two there will be a space to respond to those questions. Your task is to use complete sentences just like you would in the text dependent um, questions that we often got in the um, comprehension workstation. Use um, capital letters, use punctuation. When you get to the right section, you should write two to three sentences to answer that portion of your um, work. So let's open the Google slide. It always begins with read first. So in the read section is giving you directions on what you're supposed to read and how much of it. Notice you're not reading at all. You're reading chapters one through three of this book called Global Alert. It is assigned in benchmark. It will open the day that the lesson begins and it, the story will be open for a week out just in case somebody needs extra time to complete the work. Once you have com um, completed the reading, pages four to 14, these are the questions that you're going to respond to. Here, slide two is what you're going to click to find your responses. Now, I have a couple of responses that I've typed in. Here's the text box. I answered the question to page four. I answered the question to page eight. I know it's just silly. I didn't want to put in the actual answers and give you the answers. So I did the same thing for nine. I would have to answer number 13. And then here's my right section where I'm supposed to have two to three sentences. Once I am finished with answering the four respond questions in the right section, then I'm done. And I can then save it and put it, um, send it back to me so that I can score it. Your um, task should take about 45 minutes because remember you have to read, respond, and write. So to do all three sections should take about 45 minutes. Now, if the reading is too difficult for you, then you and your parent can use Global Alert as your 15 minutes of read aloud. Your parents can read it to you. You and your parents can popcorn read it. You can um, read it on your own if you are able to. Um, different students are going to require a different amount of scaffolding. So if you need this to be read to you, you can do that when you're listening to the story or your parents can read it to you or you can read it by yourself. When you are finished, don't forget to hand in your answers. Don't forget to hand in your slides so that I can see what you have written and so that I can respond to what you have written. Each question will have a text box for you to put your answer in. So if you have any questions, my office hours are 7.30 to 8 in the morning, 7.30 to 8.30, and then also in the afternoon about 2.30 to 3.30. So um, this is not going to be a lesson I'm teaching because Tuesday is a math lesson, but um, this is for you to do independently. So if you're unable or if you have questions, remember to contact me during office hours.